fried chicken. Arguably the greatest of all time in terms of taste, variety, and just all around enjoyability. Not only is it one of my favorite foods, it's probably one of the few foods that I can never get tired of eating. And today, I'm gonna put that to the test by replacing every single one of my meals with fried chicken. There are only two rules to the game. Rule number one is you can only eat fried chicken during this time period. You cannot eat anything else. Number two, the second rule, which is the most important one, is the amount of chicken you eat must double in quantity every single day. So today, if you eat two pieces of chicken, tomorrow you're gonna have to eat four. So that's gonna be the tough part. How do you pace yourself? Now, one thing I forgot to mention is that each of us are gonna be assigned a specific style of fried chicken that we must eat for the remainder of the challenge. And will be eating American fried chicken, I'll be eating Korean fried chicken, and since Sheldon is in Taiwan right now, he'll be eating Taiwanese fried chicken for this challenge. And in the end, we're gonna see how many pieces of chicken we can eat before we get tired of our favorite food. This video is sponsored by Squarespace. I'm gonna add one more thing, Edward. Whoever eats the least amount of chicken has to pay for everybody else's bill for the entire week. Ready? Go. All right, guys. Let's eat. Cheers. Mm. Bro, I oh. can't believe we didn't get a salt, the spice one, bro. I know how you can add a little bit of spice into your life, bro. You literally, you literally forced me to put my mom's chili on this, which is I'm not against. Mm. 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 We got three. Only three chicken wings. I know you're thinking, Sheldon, that's some small stuff. But actually in Taiwan and Asia in general, the chicken wings tend to be a lot bigger. Look how good that looks. Look at that, Look at that crunch. Let's dive in day one. Yo! What? Now, since the amount of chicken we eat every day must double, we really had to pace ourselves. Okay, all right, I'm done. I'm gonna pace myself today. But I did get a little hungry during the evening time. At 4.30, Edward says he is not, he is going to cave and eat a uh, fried like chicken sandwich. If you're gonna get that, I too might get a chicken sandwich because it only counts as one wait, piece wait, of chicken. Wait, wait. Chicken has no reason for Korean fried chicken. Yeah, I'm gonna go Google it. Korean fried chicken. Okay, yeah. it also has to be available here though. Country chicken sandwich. Wait, this is this sandwich. is any uh, Korean. Yo, uh, it curry. says country chicken. How wait, wait. country? It's not Korean. It's Korean. Bacon? Wait, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. It's Korean, not a country. Ronnie, no. Ronnie, Ronnie, Ronnie. I have to show you. I, I need to hop on a quick video call. I need to ask you a question. This one. Is this Korean fried chicken? Yeah, that's Korean fried chicken. <laughs> Tonight. Oh, fried chicken. Oh, mine came with this. Yo, 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 you're not, you're not gonna believe what I got. Oh my god, that looks so good. For y'all, oh, it kind of oh, looks yeah. similar. I'm telling you, that's not Korean fried chicken, man. That's clearly Korean fried chicken. They use a Korean fried patty in this. But Korean fried chicken has tomato and lettuce and onion in it. Korean people, you're not saying Korean people don't eat lettuce Bro, yo, and onion? Bro, that's such a That's pack. so racist. Yo. So here's the total number of fried chicken consumed at the end of day one. All right guys, I caved in. I'm getting lunch now because I'm just so hungry. And lunch is at a special spot. We're at McDonald's. Because McDonald's got McCrispy. Look at that. Crispy ass. Cheesy fried chicken right here with cheese powder. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this thigh piece. It's like the <coughs> cocaine. <laughs> yeah, it's a like cocaine. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh. How's it? Good? Give me the camera. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna let you have a bite. You're gonna let you have a bite? Let you have a bite, and then you, you tell me. You tell me. I'm a loss for words, bro. <laughs> can you see the juice? I can, yeah, it's glistening. I went for this buttermilk chicken bites right here. Nashville hot. Really excited for this fried chicken. I've heard great things about it. 4.7 stars. It's spicy Nashville flavor. This is so fire. And the sauce, mayo sauce. Bro, that's so good. The total amount eaten at the end of day two is... It is breakfast time and we are having... You guys can see. One, two, three pieces. On day three, we were still going strong. And to be honest, we weren't even close to being tired of fried chicken. Well, except Edward. All right, guys. Good morning. Sad to say that it's not that good of a morning for myself. Whole night, my 
my stomach goes on fire. Now I have stomach aches, but I'm also hungry at the same time. So I'm not that filled for some reason. I guess maybe the chicken is digesting too fast or like the spice is preventing me from feeling full, but I woke up so hungry and now I'm on the toilet and uh, I have a stomach ache. I shouldn't have went so hard on the Nashville hot flavor. Should have went for the generic, no spice. You know what, today I'm gonna tone it down on the super spicy stuff. Maybe I'll just have some of my mom's chili since it's not that spicy. Now I'm gonna do my business and um, plan out how I'm gonna eat. On to you. It's bigger than my face, guys. I give up, throw in the towel. It's not doable, guys. It's not doable. Just let it be over. Don't, no more. I'm not eating this anymore. It's enough, enough. And although Edward has given up on the challenge, you know who has never given up on us? It's our sponsor, Squarespace. Yup, it's Squarespace time. I know you guys are familiar with them and they support our channel a ton and make all these videos possible, but you know what else they make possible? creating a beautiful website. For example, let's say you wanna make a website with your own product, like how we did with our product, My Mom's Chili. It's simple. You start by picking a template, adding some graphics, your products, and there you have it. Your very own beautiful website for your amazing product. It's really that easy. And now that you've got your online store, you'll need a way to communicate with your audience for important news and events. That's why I've been using Squarespace's email campaign feature. You can introduce your brand to new subscribers with welcome emails and updates, and also keep track of all your analytics on the back end. And now to really build that community, you can even use Squarespace to engage with your audience. Just set up a blog page where you can chat with your amazing fans and keep them up to date on everything new. Now, I know you guys might be skeptical of all of this, I get it, but thankfully, I got you guys, the Ehey Gang, a free two-week trial to Squarespace. But not only that, you'll get 10% off your future subscription if you choose to continue using it after the trial. So go make that dream of yours come true and make a beautiful website with Squarespace. You can use our link in the description box below and get started today. On day four is where things started to get really tough. Sheldon and I both had to eat 24 pieces of chicken and it was starting to take a toll on us. Don't be stressed, right? Huh? Don't be stressed. Not stressed. I know I can do it. This is not as bad as uh, when we did the uh, eating nothing. That, that was so bad, bro. That was brutal. So you'd rather eat chicken for seven days than eat nothing? Yeah, I would, yeah, I would rather eat chicken than, yeah. I would rather eat food, Ronnie, than not eat food. Yeah, yeah, that makes perfect sense. All right, guys, we are here at the Taiwan KFC. KFC Taipei. I've heard nothing but good things about KFC in Asia, which is amazing to me. I've never had KFC before in Asia before. We got the KFC here. We got, this is the green pepper one. We got the maple, maple syrup one, and we got the Original. Can I do the uh, honey butter garlic? And then we'll do our original. Oh my God, look at this. This looks so good. So these look like smaller pieces. I'm gonna try to kill these off first. Yep. And then I'm gonna move on to this. Mm. Wow. That is so good, oh my God. Number two. This is the maple syrup flavor. Wow. Air fried Korean fried chicken with sauce. Ooh. Oh my god. Mm. Uh, this is the worst part of being the cameraman, bro. This place is A1, bro. This place is actually A1. If you want to eat a healthy version, I'm going to have you try one after, sure. and you'll see, like, this is pretty healthy. Yeah. <laughs> Good? Busted. Oh. Because it's slightly, it's slightly sweet, yeah. I feel like my body is perceiving this as like dessert, and I haven't had anything sweet. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And it's making me very happy. Green pepper. This is incredible. Look at the seasoning. Holy crap. Yo. This is incredible. 
It blows. Blows. Oh my god. This literally blows the fried chicken of any restaurant I've had in Toronto. Or in, even in, like, I've been to New York, LA, Boston, like all those big cities. Blows all of them out of the water. Nice. I'm done. I don't feel as weighed down. Maybe I'll feel a little bit after, but yeah, I'm done. Hey guys, it's really snowed out here and I'm shoveling the snow right now. And as I pull up my camera because I can really feel the chicken weighing down. I'm just so tired so quickly. It just doesn't feel like I'm digesting. And then it doesn't feel like I have a lot of energy. It's like, two, you hear that? It's like 2 a.m. I'm like in pain right now. Ugh, I, I, I kind of want to puke. That was rough. Ugh. We got 48 tomorrow. All right, so I got 48 pieces of chicken from Mike right here. Oh, bro, Korean fried chicken is so expensive, man, but I'm gonna set it up right now. Yo. All right, let's go. Yeah, all right, our fried chicken is here. Holy sh that's crazy. Holy. Introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Philip. All right, we got Will, my friend. Will, Will. And uh, we got all the chicken in front of us. All right, each of us got a big plate. This is a total of 48 pieces of chicken. I can't do it on my own, guys. We gotta do it together. Five minutes later. If I can finish this and I can still be alive, maybe I'll go for 96. But this is 48 pieces of chicken sitting in front of me right now. The official count apparently is 45, but I think this is 48. I am the loser, but at the same time, you can't have any until I Why? finish. Of course not. What do you mean? So You're taking you my ones? count. We're gonna start with the. Uh, this is the black. The the pepper chicken. Black pepper chicken. After every time I eat chicken, doesn't matter how much I eat, I'd be hungry for 30 minutes later. Yesterday, when I when we went to eat the brownie for lunch, I ate 10 pieces of chicken. Immediately right after, I was like, dude, I want a bowl of ramen. You are on a one track path to become a cut of a cut of. This challenge has become significantly easier the more I eat. Just whether or not, I get sick of it. I'm so glad you're still in the challenge so I can keep eating with you. Wait, this is nothing. What the hell? I'm There's sorry, nothing inside. I ate all of it already. Bro. Why are you so antisocial right now? I'd be nicer if you stuck in the challenge. When you put on day three. Don't sit beside me if you're gonna say you're gonna be the best piece of yourself. You're not even in this challenge. Yeah, but my wallet's in this challenge. My video really good. But, but yo, it's not even a physical barrier, it's a psychological barrier. I look at this and I want to puke. Why is it grumpy for, man? It's a new day, it's a fresh day, you should be happy. Can you, show not... me, can you show me a smile? How many total pieces have I had over the over the course? You had 15 just now. I had 15 just now, yesterday, yesterday I had 24. Yeah. yeah. 30, 30, 39. 39. Yeah. 24. Yeah. 39. Bro, you're soft. 50. 51. Bro, you're soft. Then you have 6. 57. And then you have 3. 60 on the dot, 60 pieces of fried chicken. I had over 40. What do you mean I'm soft? How many he had? Count. Oh, I had, I had four. One, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It doesn't end here though. Like, am I gonna stop at 60 pieces? Okay, I'm gonna stop at 60 pieces. So, at the end of day five, this is how many pieces of chicken we ate throughout the week. And the moral of the story is too much of anything will pretty much make you hate it. And I'm gonna leave you guys with this goal by Colonel Sanders. Every fried chicken that exceeds the bounds of moderation has an unstable foundation. Now click here if you wanna watch to see instant ramen for seven days straight and click here for a video that YouTube thinks you'll love.